Hello, welcome to the Honey Hobbits family homestead. Uh, today I'm going to be doing lots of mite washes. Uh, this is going to be our first time um, use, doing mite wash. I need to get a count on all of my hives and see how many mites per hundred bees we have. Uh, that'll better help me understand uh, which hives came out of winter with very few mites, which ones had a lot to, at the begin with, and um, how best I want to treat these hives. So anyway, I'm going to go through all these hives and do my wash and get counts. Um, what I do is I use a half inch measuring cup. I fill that up with a scoop of bees and I dump it in a container full of rubbing alcohol. And that unfortunately kills all the bees, but it also kills all the mites. And it gives me an extremely accurate count of the mites for the hive. Uh, a half a cup of bees is about 300 bees. So you end up taking whatever number of mites that you get and you divide that by three. So if I get three mites, that means I have one mite per hundred bees. For me, if I get anywhere in the two to three range of uh, mites per hundred, then I'm starting to get worried about that hive and I'm gonna be doing a lot of uh, treatments on it. If I'm one or lower, then I'll probably just leave them alone. Maybe do a treatment once or twice here. Let them go about their day. So anyway, this is about the most accurate way to check for mites and the the 300 bees that die um, I see as um, a worthy cause for them making sure that the rest of the hive is able to survive and when you really think about it a queen can produce or she can lay 2,000 2,500 eggs in a day so 300 bees is really not that many compared to the total population of the hive so anyway, I'm going to get in here. Hope you enjoy. We'll catch you at the end.